feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm letting it go Spend So hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to give you guys a tour of my newly finished mudroom. So this is what it looked like before. Chaotic and crazy, unfinished. Um, I had so many things, we kind of just threw everything in there while we tried to get the rest of the house done. And um, yeah, it just looked a hot mess. And I was so determined to get my mudroom done because I feel like it's the first place that we walk through the door and we see. So without further ado, this is what it looks like now. I am so in love with this space, you guys. It's so organized and it it is exactly what I envisioned. Um, I did get some inspiration from Pinterest, but this is what I had in my mind. I wanted a modern farmhouse um, look and feel, and I really do feel like I have achieved that. Um, I thought that having the rack for the jackets and then the rack for backpacks, pocketbooks was such a great idea because in my other home, um, everything was sort of just, you know, bunched up together and just disorganized and the hooks were breaking because it was, it, they were too many jackets on one hook and I just love how organized and simplistic it looks. I feel like we would definitely be able to maintain um, this mudroom. I'm not completely done. I still need to put a new light fixture in and also a new rug. Um, but I think that it, it came out great and I'm sorry for the blurriness again. I think that it came out great. Um, I think I really did achieve the look of a farmhouse or modern farmhouse um, style. And this bench, guys, what do you think? It turned out absolutely gorgeous. Um, for $19, not bad, right? And I just used um, some black paint, and I don't remember the name of it. If I find it, I will link it down below. But it is just so beautiful. It has so much storage space for all of our shoes, and it just keeps the clutter away. You don't see it, I can just put it away, all the shoes can go in there, and don't have to worry about it. And that's what I love about this mudroom, how simple it is, yet practical and functional. At first, I was kind of worried about the white walls, but I think that it looks amazing and it just brightens up the space. So this piece, this wall art, as you saw in the beginning clip, it was gold. I had it painted gold for such a long time, and so I just decided to brighten it up with some cream um, spray paint. I was going to paint it black, but I just didn't want too many black pieces in this small space. I didn't want to darken the area. I wanted it to still feel light and bright and airy. And I think that I achieved that, you guys. And I just love, love, love it so much. My family love it so much. My husband is just like, oh my gosh, if this is the way the rest of the house is gonna look, this is gonna be beautiful. There goes my thrifted item for a dollar. And I just used some greenery that I already had in the house. Um, and it just, it looks beautiful there. And I'm, I'm so loving it. My daughter's favorite spot, Nyla, I think is now the mud room before it was the downstairs bathroom. But I really think that um, she's really loving this new space. And you're going to see in the next clip, of course, um, that she is just in love with the space. She was outside and then she decided to come inside and, um, and join us for the video. So you will definitely get to see Nyla in the next clip. But if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to share and 
you know subscribe if you haven't already done so also hit that bell for new notifications and i thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to comment you guys i love talking to you guys you know i love 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 um responding to your wonderful and encouraging words um don't forget that jesus is lord and that jesus loves you and i love you too and i will see you in the next episode thanks for watching bye i've been feeling so small Watch the clock ticking off the wall But tonight I'm